it's Mikey 1000 and today we are doing a geocaching um, hunt and there's all kinds of them through our town so um, Shea Bear found this last night and so we we're gonna try it out and I didn't bring a pen do you have one so he thinks of everything it's a good thing I have him around so anyway, so we're going to go and find these and we're going to go down this trail right here. This is going to be our first event. And we're going to go through the town and find what we can find. So stay tuned. Okay guys, we are getting closer to our first one. Um, we are just down that way a little bit and we'll be there. Hopefully we'll find it. And what you do, you get your app on geocache app and it will show through your city or where you live um, how many there are and it maps everything out for you so and then you find it and you sign it and date it and then you leave it for the next person and you can also add to it right babe yep. if you want to you can add something to it so we're going to find out in just a few minutes if we find it. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so we found the geocache, the first one, and here it is right here. Hopefully you can see that. And we're going to open it up and uh, see what we got. So hang on. And it's not easy because I got Bruno with me. So we're going to drop him off on the next one. Because we're not far from the house. So he he's overheated. It's a really hot day today. So, 91. Yeah, it's 91. So we're going to probably take him home. But um, we're going to open up this one first. So you ready? Yeah. You're gonna, you want to get it? You get it. And I'll do it when we get rid of him. We'll just... Because, you know... Okay. Okay. So he's going to tie Bruno to the tree for a minute. There's a Bruno. He hasn't been feeling good either, so kind of concerned. I might have to take him back to the vets. So here we go. I'm going to go on the other side. Are you? Yeah, I think so, because it's more on the other side. Well, I'm going to bring it out here, though. Oh, you're going to get it? Okay, go ahead. Got a Thank you. Oh no, you got more. Because you wore black, they like you. Ooh, that was a big friggin' one. Huge. They don't bite. Okay, you ready? Yep. We got lots of caterpillars going on right now. Alright, so. Yep. I guess I'm gonna get this one. Monkey's gonna get the next one. Right. Yep. Wow, this is cool that yeah. we found this. Yeah. This is really cool. Yeah. And it's fun because you got to find them. Really neat. Oh, wow. Look at that. It was found February of this year, uh -huh. 16th. Oh, wow. So, last month. Oh, that's cool. And we found it. Yep, yeah, and we found it. So, a little piece of paper there. There's some matches. Oh. And here in a minute, I'll read to you about it. These matches are designated, as, designed especially for damp climates, but they will not light when wet or after long exposure. So that's pretty cool. Uh -huh. An old match book. Yeah. Next time neat. we'll bring stuff in, we'll leave. Yeah, I'd like people. to get some um, stickers uh, and put them in there. So that's cool. Yeah, yeah our stickers. Yeah. So, let's go with the, right, I'm going to go ahead and shut mine off, yep. and I'm going to sign this, and then I'll read about, there's a, uh, there's a story about this, this is historical here, so. Okay. Okay. This is congrats to Bulldog Love for FTF. For those of you that don't know, that means first to find. 
So that was who was the first one to find this. Uh -huh. um, it says this is our first obscure history series. Hopefully everyone will enjoy learning about Citrus County history that didn't make the mainstream history books. You are seeking our very first lock and lock. We put a pen in, but it's always good, always a good idea to have one handy, which we brought. <coughs> Pens don't last forever in Florida heat. No. So, when you find this cache located on the Whitlacoochee State Trail, you will be standing at the very place that forever changed Citrus County. Really? This spot right here. Originally, the rail line was to pass through this area, which is now a ghost town. Arlington. This is called Arlington. You're standing in a ghost town. Oh, wow. Hence these old bricks. Mm-hmm. And the old bricks. Yeah, I noticed these bricks. Okay. Oh, um, wow. Isn't that cool? And continue along this barely visible grade into what is now the Whitlacoochee State Forest and near the county seat, Manfield. That's where the cemetery is. Right. Remember, we yep. went there and we did the We were at thing? there, yep. yep. We did a video on That's it. That's where this ran to. Oh, cool. After the forced relocation of the county seat to Tompkinsville, now known as Inverness, so mm -hmm. this used to be called Tom Tom Tompkinsville. Tompkinsville. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the discovery of phosphate in Floral City, which is just a few miles right. down the road from us. Uh, the rail line the rail line was redirected to the path which is now the Whitlacoochee State Trail, which is Right. This trail there. that we've been We're on that we showed you. Yeah. Okay. That's so, very interesting. The grade was already done. Rock was already poured. The rail gate, the rail grade that was never a rail line is still visible in the Whitlacoochee State Forest as Trail 9 to this day. You can still find granite along this trail. The rerouting of the rail line caused towns along the planned route to disappear. Some that still show on some maps include Orleans and Landrum. Hmm. The Citrus County we know today would be quite a different place had the change not occurred. Yet to this day, this place remains unmarked until now. So no one until... So, Florida Terra Blazer. Really? Well, <laughs> I didn't see him here. No, no. Uh -uh. So, this is really cool. <laughs> okay. And it's fun. You can actually still see the grade on Google Maps. And follow it right over top a Australian sounding restaurant and into the forest. Australian sounding restaurant. What one would that be? Australian? Australian sounding restaurant. So anyway, that's our first one. I'm gonna know. go ahead and log it and I'm gonna put found it. Say it it'll say found it or DNF. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. The DNF means did not find. So we're going to put found it. Okay. Cool. Yep. All right, guys. We're yeah. going to drop him off and yeah. we're going to go on we're to the next one. Yeah. And we're going to adventure. And the next one's not that far from the house, right? No, it's at the park at the end of the road. Oh, so I we'll go my there. viewers up there on the John Deere one day. Yeah. John Deere, John Deere vlogging. Check out that video. Yeah. I strapped a camera. That's uh -huh. before we had any action cams or GoPros. I strapped that big old camera on the hood of the tractor. Right. Remember? Mm -hmm. And I put it on sponges so it wouldn't vibrate as much. Right. So. All right, guys. On to number two. Yep. So stay tuned for more. Be back. Okay guys, so now we're at the park. We have dropped Bruno off at the end of my street. This is the park that has one. I've done videos here. We put the drone up here over there, way over on that piece of property over there. So Shea Bear's got the app and so I follow him and we're going to go find this. So it should only take a few minutes, hopefully. So as soon as we find it, I will show you. Be back. Okay, so we're at number two. Yep. We have found it. Monkey's going to open this one. 
and I'll show you. She's showing hers right now. I'll show there you. There it is. Pretty cool. And I'll let him show you. Show. And then she'll get it out. And then right there. Pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Hard and it, 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 it's amazing because, you know, we come here. <laughs> we never realized all this. Okay, this so is cool. going to get that out. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to get it out. Lots of caterpillars around. And then I'll read about this one. Here we go. See? Cool beans. Can you hold that on camera for me? Please? Okay, we're going to open this up. There's a piece of paper stuck in the very bottom of it. can't get it out. I need it. Maybe my keys or something might go in there? No. Mm -mm. I got it. There okay. we go. And someone didn't put it back in the bag. Or it got out of the bag somehow. Okay, so here's your little letter. And it was done on 11, I think that's 10, I don't have my glasses on, 10 or 16. Of 12, 27, 20 was the last one. Oh, on the bottom? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. And it looks like, like two people have done this, found this one. So that's pretty cool. That's this neat. Was, this one was placed here in 2012. Yeah? Yes. It was placed here in 2012. Mm-hmm. Um, see here the uh, last person that logged it though um, it was found January 11th of this year so let's read the description mm -hmm. an easy cash find in a nice park this is my first hide you are looking for a matchstick container that's what that is mm -hmm. At a pleasant little park, I found wild geocaching in the area. So they found this place while they were yeah. looking for other stuff. Congratulations to Cruiser 352 for a fast FTF. First oh. to find. That's pretty cool. And that was 2012. Wow. Okay. So we're going to write our, I'm going to write our things on here. And yeah. we'll get it put back in there. Okay. Cool beans. of it for you. Okay, let me log this. Log. Mm -hmm. Found it. Mm -hmm. Cool. I'm going to take a picture of there it. There you go. Hold it up, straight up. Okay. Neat. Very cool. So, like he said, he's going to write on it, and then we'll continue to the next one. So stay tuned. Hey guys, we are now on the road at a different park. Uh, Inverness is known for a lot of parks. So this, uh, this one's called White Lake Park, in, uh, city of Inverness. And Shea Bear's already gone because he's so excited. Um, <laughs> Yeah, this is basketball place where they play basketball. I see a basketball over there. And they got a picnic table here. I really haven't, I've driven by this every day, but I've never really stopped here. Because I don't really play basketball, but pretty cool. So we're going to see where it is. And we'll be right back. Okay guys, we've been looking and Shea Bear finally found it. It is, whoa. I looked at this palm, but I lifted up all the palms around it and I didn't look in the inside. And there it is way in there. So Shea Bear's going to take it out and he's going to open this one. It did take us a little bit. It said camouflage, so. Yeah, but it said one gallon. Yeah, this is not, a, not gallon. a gallon. So That's okay, I mean, yeah. I put here in 2005. Uh-huh. By two fill bellies. Yeah. 
That's cool. And it's fun. Okay, so monkey's back. My camera's steaming up. Mm-hmm. I've got stuff all over my lens. Okay, so let's open this up. Cool, let's see what we got. We got our little paper to mm -hmm. sign in on. Mm-hmm. There's also Isn't that cute? It's a little keychain. Little keychain. Aww. Now we leave this stuff here, but you can add stuff and yeah, a little domino. Yeah, cool. Back of the key keychain says, "This is Vinny the Vampire. I am a cash buddy. Please log me on www.geocache.com and move me to another cache." Oh, so we could take it and move them. Yeah, but um, I don't know how to do that yet. Well, the next one we go to, you just put him in there. Oh, because then there's... But you have to change it, though. Oh, on the website. Yeah, or people oh, okay. be looking here for days and not find it. And right. It. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> going to leave it here because... Yeah. All right. Okay, so this was last found. Okay, see, it was logged in as it was found 32221, and that's what we got here. So, all right. So, we're going, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to, I'm going to sign our names on here. Yep. We're going to put this back in here, and, and I'm going to log it in so they know we found it. Right. So this was just found five days ago. Yeah. So, all right, guys, and then we're going to go on to number four. And each time you get a smiley face of where you found them. Yeah, on your app. On the app. Yeah. So That's this cool. Will be the third smiley face. Yeah. All right. So, so we'll write our names, and then we'll go to the next one. Okay. Okay, guys, now this is our fourth one. And it's around a bridge. So we got to look for it. And this is near our camping area where we go camping down this road. So we're going to look around here. Are you? Okay. So it says it's near the bridge. And this is our bridge here. You found it? Ah, uh, he found it already. Pretty cool. So we go over here. Isn't it pretty out here? Ah. Uh, to make sure I don't fall. Film that? Yep. And it's right in here. It was supposed to be a uh, metal key thing, but oh, that's, that's okay. cool. Yeah, because people might change it because they go bad or get rusty or. You know, full of water or, or something. Or some people just steal that shit. Yeah, yeah, true. So, he's going to open it up in just a few minutes. Be back. Monkey's going to get this one out here. There we go. A little bottle. Okay, let's see what's in it. Hmm. Looks like I got a little water in here, but that's okay. That's what's in there. Okay, there's our thing. Yeah, this is your paper. It has a little plastic thing around it. So I'm gonna bring it out so you guys can see it. Now I'll read on this one. Oh. What is now one has found this by this piece of paper? Well, that's probably just new paper because it says it was found 227 of 21. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, this was put here in 2005. Uh-huh. So it's probably just a new paper. Oh, okay. You are, this one is called um, Brogdon Troll because, you know, trolls live under bridges. So right. that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's neat. And the description was, you are seeking a magnetic key holder, an interesting... An interesting spot on the way to Potts Preserve. So. Very cool. Cool. All right. Awesome. So I'm going to sign these out. Sign this 
sign it for us and Put you wanna do you wanna do more? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. yeah. Of course. Yeah. Okay, so she's not done yet. We'll go do some more. Here we are. We found it. We are in Whispering Pines Park. And here it is, right there. Oh, well, this is taped. Oh, cool. It's camouflage yeah. duct tape. Oh, neat. Okay, so yeah. Let me get behind the sun here. Here it is. Cool. That's cool. Open this up. See what kind of goodies are in here. There's our log book. Ah, cute. One of those things from McDonald's or Burger King or something. That's cute. A little toy. Ah. Little toy. Mickey Mouse! <laughs> this one's chock full of stuff. Yeah. There's my fluffy. Oh shit. Ah, minion! I thought it was a monkey. <laughs> when you said that. A minion. A minion. We also have a lion. We have a lion. <laughs> we also have uh, more Mickey Mouse stickers. These are put in, you can take one. Yeah. If you want. So here you can have one. Thank y'all. And we also have another domino and, and two nickels. Cool. Which we will not take the nickels. No. I don't have Is any Is there change. an old year on them or something? No. No? Okay. So, that's pretty cool. Yeah. So we'll put these in here. Very neat. This one had the most in them. Yeah. Yeah. Very cool. Okay, so I'm going to sign our paper for us. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to log in. And I'll kick you guys back on. Okay. Okay, guys, we are on our sixth one. And we are at a corner. And Shea Bear has found it again. And it was inside the stop sign. Yep, this is what, number six? Yep. It was stuffed up under there. And there you go. It's called a micro. Ah, micro. See? Yep. So it's real tiny. Yep. Let's unscrew this. Can you, can you get that? Let me get my glasses on here. That's cool. We were so close. And there you go. And there it is. Wow. That's I don't neat. usually like sticking my fingers up in there, but I thought, man, it keeps pinging me right here. Yeah. We were on top of like The last said. one was here last month, February. Yep. Ah, oh, neat. Look at so. all the people that found it. Yeah, this really one, cool. let me see if I can get the information. Okay. The, uh, the description <coughs> is just a simp simple traditional cache. The location provides for easy access and convenient parking adjacent to the hike. So it should be a park and grab, okay? And the hint is coded. See that? Yeah. The hint is coded. Wow. So, 
but I'll read to you. I figured out what it says. It says, do you think that Hendrix would stoop so low to stop at Zephyr? Zephyr. This is Hendrix and Zephyr. Right. So, yeah. that's, that's the hint. So, here it was on the stop sign. Cool. So, that is cool. It was put here in 2017. It was last found um, February 20th of this year. Oh, neat. So, cool. Yep. All right, I'm going to sign our names. We're going to log in. And there you go. And I'll do my outro after a bit. Hang tight, guys. So, that ends the day for today. We found Oliver. Well, Shea Bear found most of them. <laughs> I just followed him, but it's fun and we had a good time. It was a great day. A little bit too hot for Bruno, but it was a pretty good day. So we're gonna probably do this again. And like he said in his video, they they charge you for the better ones. You can get three dollars a month, I guess. And you can go and find more and it's more stuff and more technical and stuff like that but these ones that we're doing are all free on your app so you go to your app and uh, download it and see how many are in your area and try it out so I'm gonna say I'm out for now and I will see you in the next one bye y'all